Yo, welcome back. Zykor here. And today in No Man's Sky, well, I'm I'm in a storm. Yeah, this this is a storm on this planet that I just had to blow in right when I was going to start. Uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's just out of dust. Um, I'd like to go and get uh, the Atlas Pass. I'd like to try and start that because I've been kind of needing it to get into some of the hidden areas, I guess. Not necessarily hidden areas, but locked things, like the locked crates and stuff. So, I'm going to get in here since there's a storm anyway. And as far as I know, I think what you need to do is you have to do the Space Anomaly quest with Nada and Polo. Um, at least that's what it looks like on the wiki because <laughs> I can't fully remember I had the Atlas Pass at one time a long time ago but I can't actually remember fully how I got it so I gotta kind of just go by the wiki so I'm gonna go up here and summon the anomaly I don't think I have the anomaly in this system do I or do I that's that's a freighter, I think. Yeah. Okay, let's just summon the anomaly right here. There we go. Go in. Talk to probably Polo. He's usually the one you talk to in there. It says I need to share the portal experience with Nada. Okay. have to see. I guess I should check out the, the Nexus mission as well, just to see if there's anything interesting. But, I don't know if I'd want to check them out before I talk to Polo or after. Or Nada, actually. I need to talk to Nada, not Polo. Yep, can I? Coming up to Nada's balcony. Haha, <laughs> the easy way. Okay, so it's Nada I need to talk to. There we go. Traveler entity. It has been some time. Polo has missed you. Explain the portal. Yeah, what? Uh, I would like to know what they mean, but uh, I'll explain the portal. That's the topic here. I explained my journey through the portal, my vision of the strange world on the other side, how I awoke a long way from my ship. Nada looks at me with concern. Traveler, your journey was longer you might realize. Wait, your journey was longer you might realize. I think they forgot a van. Maybe. <laughs> Portals have much in common with our home. Their travel is anomalous. Unless I'm, I could have been reading that differently too. Who knows? <laughs> but you are unharmed, yes? You feel complete. You feel not crimson? Not crimson? I... I guess? I feel complete, I think? My arms and legs are there. Nada is pleased. Old portals are strange, but so is our home. Polo is clever. Atlas false entity cannot see us. Polo uses Atlas false uh, falsity against themselves. What? Polo uses Atlas falsity against themselves. Okay. I think he's saying that Polo uses Atlas stuff against Atlas, not, not against... Polo. It sounds kind of weird. <laughs> okay, now, speak with Polo and other life forms aboard the anomaly. Polo holds coordinates for black holes and atlas stations. Travelers Helio Helios and Ares offer supplies of nanites. Oh, okay. They'll give me nanites. Let's see. Uh, I'm a little too close to you, Polo. I don't want to be that close. That's, that's not comfortable. How are you? Are you hungry? is customary greeting for old friend yes I told you Nada would be fine 
I, I told Nada you would be fine, traveler friend. Poor Nada. They do get nervous. Ask about strange worlds, ask for Atlas Station coordinates, ask for black hole coordinates. Hmm. Um strange worlds. Is this portal hmm. I wonder if they changed how you get an Atlas Pass. I'm not fully sure. They might have. Uh, ask about strange worlds. Let's see what that gives me. One such place. Once, such places did not exist. Could not be seen. But now, every second more appear. They seep through a new creation. I do not know where these new worlds come from. What lies beyond our boundaries. I do not think I will ever know. But they are exciting to see. Yes. That was actually a question. <laughs> Look for a way to help Artemis. Polo holds coordinates for black holes and atlas stations. Okay. So. Purchase technology blueprints for new base parts aboard the anomaly. Undertake missions with other travelers from the Nexus or exchange discoveries and rare products for nanites. Hmm. Okay. Well, uh... So there is no at anomaly quest? I'm not really sure how to get the Atlas Pass then. I'll ask for Atlas Station coordinates. That will do it, friend. But please be careful. We would hate to see you leave us. Hopefully he gave me that. Might as well ask him for black hole locations too. Why not? Oh, Atlas. Huh. Of course, friend. A whole galaxy for you. Just for you. You must see it all. Okay, I don't know if he actually gave me locations for them, but... Well, let's see. Um, I'm supposed to go here. Am I supposed to buy something? Well, I do have 20 salvage data. I could get something. A biodome, I... I am tempted to get that biodome, although the holo door seems interesting too. Never put one in. An elegant holographic door which allows quick access to any structure while regulating the temperature and toxicity. Wait, no. Toxicity of the interior. Okay. Let's see. I uh, have all those. I don't need those. Well, the metal wouldn't be too bad. It might be interesting, but... Eh. Um, the half wall is interesting as well. Flora containment. But that's just decoration. And I might as well just finish the quest for those things. I'm almost done with it. Um, floor switch. And a button. I still haven't fully figured out how to use these, to be completely honest. <laughs> so, I have to figure it out. I'll have to do some testing around with them sometime. I think I forgot to mention, if you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe as well. That really helps me out. Okay, um... Oh, you know what? I should get the nutrient processor because I should do something like that. Just cooking, you know? Seems like it could be interesting. Uh, teleport cable, short-range teleporter. That could be interesting to use. But I don't really want to hang around here too much. Of course, this health station actually is interesting because I think it, you can just keep using it. I don't think you have to recharge it. That is tempting. Because then I could recharge my health since I am kind of damaged. And that's about it. Okay, so... Um, Q. 
cuboid room? I'm not fully sure what those is. I never really used them. We stacked or linked to form larger structures. Hmm. Maybe I should test around with them sometime. Curved cuboid wall. Oh, glass cuboid room. Oh, hey, those sound actually interesting. Maybe I should build a base out of these. You know what? Let's just see. New building part learned. So, cuboid room foundation strut. A sturdy leg for supporting cuboid rooms. That's a one. I wonder if I need it. But I guess I'll have to get it just in case. Curved. That's a foundation strut quad. Set of four legs for supporting cuboid rooms. Flooring. Hardware composite floor panels cut for cuboid rooms. Hmm. And frame. Lightweight support structures with, which can be stacked or linked to form large industrial structures. Huh. Uh, maybe I'll get the flooring. Um, I don't know about that. I don't know if I want it sitting up on something. I'd prefer it to be just kind of on the ground, so I'd have to see how that works. Uh, the glass, I would definitely want. Wow, that takes silver. Oh, nuts. These take silver to make? Oh, no, that's pure ferrite. This is pure ferrite, too. Roof cap, inner wall, interior stairs, infrastructure ladder, inner door. Oh, there's a lot on this stuff. Window. If you have glass, why do you need window? Self-cleaning, UV-treated, hermetically sealed glass. Okay, well, but that's actually a better window, this one. I don't like the square one. Get that one. And then the curved cuboid roof, because why not? I'm not going to have any salvage data left. <laughs> um, okay, so I have to get this. I don't have a choice. Well, I guess that allowed me to go around corners. So now I only got four left, so I got to choose wisely. Stairs, wall, inner door, infrastructure ladder. Um, I wonder what kind of a ladder. Used in conjunction with structural platforms to allow the user to reach great heights with ease. Uh, maybe I can wait on that. Roof cap. I don't know if I fully need that. This is a roof, so why would I use that? Ah, you know, I'll save my salvage data. I'd like this, kind of, but nah, it's not that useful, I don't think. Oh well, let's see. Now, uh, I got a whole bunch of blueprints. Um, now, I needed to go over to... I'm gonna go over to Helios and Ares. I'm not sure if... Maybe their name is Helios? I'm not fully sure on that. That's Hesperus, Gemini. Okay, so... Okay, so it was that I just hadn't... I had been never able to talk to these guys, so must have just been I hadn't unlocked them yet. Oh. Return another day. Okay. He won't let me do anything anyway. Okay. Maybe I can't talk to these guys after all. Helios. Oh, he's now talking to me. Leave me to rest, please. Okay, so they... Are okay. I guess they're not going to give me anything. What are you... What is this wanting me to spend salvage data? I just spent my salvage data. Why are you wanting me to spend more? Okay. So. Um, look for a way to help Artemis. So, technically, I'm absolutely not sure at all how to get the Atlas Pass. They must have changed it. It used to be... An, an anomaly quest. Now, I have absolutely no idea. Well, let's see what there is for Nexus missions. Liquid explosive? What is that? War Piper Core, Nanites, Planetary Depot. That always ends in, in a bad way for me. 
I end up dying in these. <laughs> because for some reason, my personal force field doesn't work. And I don't know if they intentionally did that or not. Oh, I got 1,500 nanites. That's probably from selling stuff. Yeah. Selling those... Uh, eh, none of these are very good. So, yeah. Yeah, that's probably from selling the modules I got from scrapping ships. Because you do get a lot of nanites. Where's my ship? Oh, there. Okay, so... Um, nuts. I want that S Atlas Pass. And I don't know... Do you have to take the at... I mean... I don't think the Atlas Path does anything. Reach the black hole. Okay, so that's nothing. And this is just continuing on the story. And the, ne the anomaly doesn't really do anything for you anymore. Can you even get an Atlas Pass? Hmm. You know what? I'm going to do a little bit of research and I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, as far as I found, uh, Holo doesn't give them anymore. I guess I'm out of date. And apparently there's been many other people that are out of date as well. <laughs> so somehow it got removed from Polo. Um, as far as I saw, the only way to actually get it is to raid the manufacturing facilities. So, it seems like it's actually rather difficult. But, I'll try it. So, where is the space station? I'm going to see if I can find any manufacturing facilities here. Get in here. Have the cartographer search for manufacturing facilities. And we'll see what I find. Up here. It's kind of odd. I didn't, I mean, I don't know why they ch would change that. Hopefully I have my navigation data on me. And exchange maps. So this is for secure site of interest so that is probably the manufacturing facilities commercial alien yeah that's inhabited outpost so probably this secure site of interest let's see get on here uh, where did that go in my massive no oh, there. Supply depot. I don't want a supply depot. Can you please give me a manufacturing facility? They still need to show you how much navigation data this ha you have on you on that screen. Manufacturing facility, there we go. That's kind of a nice one, but it's only a C rank. I think it's small. Okay, head out. Okay, where is that manufacturing facility? Uh, which one is it? Oh, there. No, would you stop sending me over there? What? Why? Why does it have to... I don't understand that. Am I doing something wrong that it automatically sends me to the first thing? What is it? No, the, the thing that's closest to me. Now, I'm gonna... There we go. Sheesh. It was so far away. Down here. 
when I land, I'm gonna make sure my my personal force field works. It should. Okay. No, my personal force field does not work. Hmm. Is there a reason? Do I have to, like, get away? No. Um, utilities. Change secondary weapon. Force field. There, now it's on. Did it somehow get unequipped? I wonder. Or... Or does it get unequipped when you change your multi-tool? Equipped right now. Yeah, this is my, my better one, I think. Okay. So I have a for, for personal force field. I'm gonna grab this. Blast this door open. Scatter buster. Well, let's see. Oh, I'll, I might as well reload first because <laughs> it's better to have a good amount of reload. Of course, they're firing at me. Run in. There we go. Oh, grab the nanites. Okay. Okay, let's see. Approach the terminal, but something deep within the complex is malfunctioning. Surfaces feel hot to the touch. And machinery clanks and whirs. And alert sounds. And Lisa Befung... I can't read that. <laughs> the alarm rings in my ears. A bead of sweat rolls the slowly down my forehead. Engage coolant chamber network. Activate fusion dampening field. Initialize laser refraction systems. I'm not fully sure how you decode these. I should look that up. Well, let's activate fusion dampening field. Why not? Cause the power surge. Terminal shorts and cuts out. The system no longer responds to my commands. I'm nuts. No! I failed. Okay. Well, at least the sentinels aren't targeting me anymore. Yeah, I'm not fully sure how to decode those. I'd have to look that up. I wonder if there's another one. Actually, let's see if I can use my my scanner. Uh, do I have do I have my signal booster right? Yep, there we go. Let's see. Can I detect other ones? Like this, hopefully. Is that another one over here to the left? Hopefully that is, but we'll see. Manufacturing facility. Haha. -ha. Let's head over there. I'll leave a trail of failed <laughs> failed manufacturing facilities. <laughs> like right over here. And where's my... No, no. I'm going to have to round again. Go around. There we go. It 
you always have to use the landing pads because hey, you end up <laughs> keeping your fuel. <laughs> it's cheap. Okay. Let's try this one. Now I should reload. There we go. Okay. They haven't gotten to me yet. There we go. Get the nanites in here. Okay. Let's just try to read this carefully. Control terminal before me appears to be for some sort of deep level mining system. However, all systems have stalled. The screen flashes a readout. And it, I can't read it. Production. This is in GEC. Something about production. Nuts. I need to know more words. Warning lights blink on and off. A material hopper opens. Well, I know I'm not in cert hand. It's trying. It's talking about the production. Ferrite dust or carbon. Nuts. Um. Let's try. I guess ferrite dust. Choking, grinding sound that follows does not sound positive. The machinery shuts down completely. I fear I have flooded important internal components with metallic dust. That's another one failed. <laughs> okay. Is it like always the first option? Hey, that's an interesting ship. That's an A rank, not a large one. Though. Okay, let's try another one. See if there is any more. I guess that I need to know more languages, or not languages, more words of the languages. Maybe that would help. But I want that Atlas Pass. Is there another one? Let me guess there ain't another one. That's what it found? Trading post. Okay. Eh, I didn't find one. Let's see what happens if I scan again. Do I have drop pod coordinate data? Oh, I, I can't scan again. Why does it seem like I have one? Oh, you know. Okay, I have one. <laughs> That's weird. Well, I guess I'll head over to that drop pod. I mean, why not? Okay, well, uh, this... Man. This manufacturing facilities I need to actually decrypt. Oh, nuts, that's really far. I'll have to go back to the... Actually, maybe I should do it in a system where I know more languages of the of the species. No more languages of the species. What, what am I saying? No more words of the species of the language. There. But I'll get this drop pod coordinate. Drop pod coordinate. This drop pod. Do you even speak that core? Of course, this episode's probably getting a little long. Okay, do I have what it takes? I have antimatter. I don't have any ionized cobalt, do I? I don't see any. So, is there any cobalt around here? Is there any caves? I can create a cave. No. 
nothing here. Cave there. Well, let's see what happens if we create a cave. Okay, I'm down to the center of the earth. And nothing. And I can't even see to get out. This is kind of a hard one to get out of. <laughs> Okay, no cave. Ah. You angry? What did I do? And I gotta reload my scatter bus. Of course. Might as well scan it. What? I just reloaded. Ah, nuts. I must have interrupted it. There we go. Well, he was attacking me. Okay, so I need ionized cobalt. I have to find some. Wish it would give me cobalt. That's not fair. Oh, you know, I might as well chart this area. Okay, I wonder if there's any caves. Because all I need is a cave. I don't want to bother repairing it if there's no caves here. Is there any type of cave or anything? Well, this is a little bit of a depression, but not really a cave. over here. What about this one? Is this just a depression as well? Oh, here we go. That would be cobalt. Good. Okay. Uh, oh, mining. I passed it. I'll have to make some ionized cobalt. After I get this, I guess I'll probably have to end this episode off. Well, I learned I learned something at least. You can't get the Atlas Pass from Polo anymore. You can only get it from manufacturing facilities. I just haven't got it yet. Oh, I got plenty of there, I got plenty of it. Okay, where's my spaceship? There we go. I didn't intend to land. Why are you... Haha, I get you stuck in the crack. Let's get over here. Okay, set out my refiner. Wrong button. Right there. Put my cobalt in. You know, I should make sure that it takes ionized cobalt just because, I mean, you know, never know. Ionized cobalt, yep, I'm right. Sodium nitrate. I did see sodium. have sodium nitrate anyway. Where's my cobalt? Cobalt, where'd you go? There we go. Fuel this. There we go. That'll give me 130. Okay, I'll just start by repairing some of these other portions. Got that repaired. This repaired. So it's just this then.
Okay, so... Do I have 55 yet? Yeah, I should. There we go. Okay, get this repaired. There we go. Okay, so I need my cargo slot. Because I haven't finished them yet. <laughs> Okay, now I'd like. I still need. To, no, this is done. I still need to find another manufacturing facility, though, so. But, yeah, this episode's probably getting coming to a close here. Not, not enough fuel. <laughs> no! Uh, okay. Uh, nope, wrong way. There we go. But I guess um, I was going to head to. Let's see here. What other places can I go to? Uh, how much language do I know? Catalog. Or that's not catalog. It's is it guide? Or milestones. So. How many words? Total nine. How many? Hmm. It doesn't specifically tell me words collected. Um, I've learned 94 words, but it doesn't necessarily tell me how many Gek words I've learned. It just says total of nine. Four out of five words. I mean, have I only learned nine Gek words? Really? 73 Viking words. 10 Corvax words. So I guess I should head to a Viking system because I've learned 73 words. So what Viking system do I have to go to? I guess... Go watch. Yeah, I'll head there. Isomat... Uh, that's kind of a bad economy. I'll go to Ugawaj. Actually, I was going to go to that ancient ruin. But I guess I'll leave that for next time. Maybe I can try to find manufacturing facilities again <laughs> next time. Uh, it's going to be a task. And maybe I can get a better... Maybe I can look up some information to see if I can get anyone you know any information on it there <laughs> so yeah I guess if you like this episode hit that like button really appreciate it really helps me out a lot if you haven't already subscribed hit that bell icon leave a comment share it all that good stuff and yeah I'm gonna get this ancient ruin here see what it is just show me directions to some place. Probably just, I can probably get to it like a, a artifact here. Oh, get this. Turn a gek word. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.